My name is Megan. I'm 14 years old and I participated in First Lego League. Hi, my name is Katie. I'm Hisha. My name is Annika. My name is Aileen. I'm 15 years old. I'm 18 and I participated in First Robotics Competition. First Lego League. I've participated in First for eight years. As a mentor for the past five years now. My name is Christine and I'm a mentor for First. I knew from the minute I saw this that this is something I really wanted to do. I was so intrigued by the robots, by the teams, and most importantly by the competition that I realized that I really want to do this. So the following year, I decided to join an FLL team. I actually didn't think that robotics would really be something I'd be interested in, so I initially said no. My brother and the rest of my family kind of pushed me into it anyways, and I'm glad that they did, because otherwise I wouldn't have realized how much I enjoy it. I always had an interest in creating things. I thought it'd be cool to animate those using programming. I liked Transformers movies growing up. I thought the social stigma against girls being involved in robotics would make me seem nerdy. In the end, it didn't really matter, because it turned out I loved it. I worked on electrical and mechanical aspects of building the robot. I actually had the opportunity to be the driver, acted as a team captain. When they needed me to be administrative, they needed me to work on the awards team, and that's where I was. And when they needed me to be mechanically inclined, that's where I was. My personal favorite would probably be building the attachments because you can add on to what you already created and then you can animate it to do basically whatever you want. This has given me a lot of opportunity to put forth my ideas and make them into something. Because I did FIRST Robotics, I feel like I can do almost anything. Because of FIRST Robotics, I learned how much I really enjoy problem solving and engineering. After I joined FIRST, I realized my passion for science. It definitely changed the way I look at things, so if I see something to do with technology. Oh, this is maybe how they did this, and I think about the process of how they did that. Because I chose FIRST Robotics, I decided to pursue mechatronics, engineering, and university. All I had to do was push myself, show them that I am capable of working with the robot, working with the guys. Because of FIRST Robotics, I discovered a lot about myself, and I've learned it's okay to feel confident in your abilities. You see the confidence, particularly in some of the girls, start to grow. You see their, their skills develop. You see their just enthusiasm and their passion and in turn sort of take fire. It felt great to know that you were capable of doing anything that needed to be done on the robot. The guys at robotics usually don't think that girls can do what they can, but I think that we can do it even better. As a girl in engineering, I hope that I can go and show other girls that they're also capable. I think sometimes as females we don't realize that we can be good at some of those things and we just have to give ourselves a chance to try. If you're interested or you think you might be interested, just go out and try it because you never know what your passion might be. Your first step is enter the door and once you get in, you will have vast opportunities. Straight up, if you love it, do it.